Block nurses play an immense role in regional anesthesia service. The Nysoras Regional Anesthesia Service substantially increased the operating room efficiency and allowed for an increase in the number of daily cases thanks to the help by anesthesia nurses as well as by regional anesthesia service that we implemented. But that's all because all anesthetics procedures are performed in the block room, including spinal, epidural, and nerve block anesthesia. As an example, our orthopedic surgery program is done under regional anesthesia for over 95% of all patients. However, without block nurses, the regional anesthesia service in a hospital would not be possible. A study by Duke University reported that introduction of a regional anesthesia block nurse in a team in the preoperative holding area not only increased patient safety, but substantially increased the perioperative efficiency and productivity and decreased delays to the operating room start times. In this video, we describe the immense role of the regional anesthesia block nurse and the many benefits of implementing a dedicated regional anesthesia nurse team in a perianesthesia setting. I thank you for all you do for our service. Hey, good morning. We're starting our day here with an explanation as to how important the perioperative nurses and the nerve block nurse really is during the application of regional anesthesia. So here we have a typical setup for an axillary brachial plexus block. Here's a transducer in the axillary fossa. And here we can see the axillary brachial plexus uh, anatomy. So you see there's a really very large vessels there. There's arteries. That's the large axillary vein. If you depress, and there's an axillary artery. So there's a lot of things that can go wrong with the vessels, with the nerves, and during the application of the block. So what the nerve block nurse really does uh, in our practice, she does multiple levels of monitoring. First off, there's a monitoring of the cardiovascular and oxygenation system. Then there's a monitoring of nerve stimulation. There's a monitoring of injection pressure. And finally, monitoring of the intravascular needle placement. So the black nurse will, at any given point in time, report if there's an accidental motor response during the performance of the nerve block, which may indicate that the needle is in touch with the nerve and signals the clinician to stop advancing the needle. Secondly, if there is a high injection pressure during the injection, the nurse would stop immediately because the high injection pressure may signify, again, that the needle is in touch with the nerve or inside the nerve fascicle. And finally, just before the injection, in every two to three milliliters, the nurse will aspirate while watching at the hub of the needle because the hub of the needle is the first indication of the intravascular needle placement. So the role of the nurse in this process is immense. Perioperative nurses and nerve block nurses have a huge role and they are vital in successful practice of regional anesthesia. It is not secret that for success in anything you need a team. Like the nursing and regional anesthesia teams for our orthopedic service, and Nysora team has just produced another blockbuster, the NeuroBlock app. This is Nysora's fabled NeuroBlock app, something that we are super proud of as it has been downloaded by over 100,000 professionals worldwide. With the app, you can learn or teach 60 Nysora's highly practical standardized NeuroBlock techniques. You can access a gallery of original instructional illustrations, images, or videos or watch the 3D anatomy videos to understand the techniques and improve the success rate. The app is loaded with amazing visuals and Nysora's reverse ultrasound anatomy animations which accelerate learning of the sonar anatomy patterns. The app features practical tips from the Nysora's Fable Boutique workshops. I invite you to download yours for a free trial and see why the Nysora Nerblack app is used by our colleagues worldwide.